A Seven News investigation's uncovered a shocking loophole that allows those on home detention to freely roam the streets. They're using a simple household item to beat the system. It's a ridiculously easy hack, so simple it's almost unbelievable. Seven News can reveal accused and convicted criminals are using aluminium foil to cheat home detention. It's a systematic failure. One man who doesn't want to be identified told Seven News a family member was rarely home when he was meant to be on home detention. He was constantly out, constantly, every week, two or three times a week. How? Wrap the ankle bracelet in alfoil so only the last signal would be sent to the monitoring centre. The Corrections Department knows this has been happening but believes only a small amount of the more than 600 people currently on home detention try to beat the system. The department says it has a number of surveillance techniques. We also use other uh, measures such as telephone calls, random home visits, uh, targeted home visits based on intelligence. But when our informant went to his family member's case manager about it, this is what he says he was told. Look, we know that your family member is leaving the house, but he's not considered dangerous. Our members have enough problems doing their own jobs without having equipment that isn't up to scratch. The offender is now back in prison on unrelated matters, but our informant says the public should be aware of the loopholes in the scheme. Stacey Lee, 7 News. 7 News has been given an exclusive behind-the-scenes look at the headquarters that monitors home detention. The Corrections Department was forced to make urgent changes after 7 News exposed how some people were cheating the system. It's the simple hack some on home detention have been using to foil the system. Wrap the ankle bracelet in alfoil so only the last signal would be sent to the monitoring centre. Our bombshell report caught the Corrections Department off guard. Certainly the practice as described in the Channel 7 story uh, was not one that I was uh, immediately aware of. It sparked urgent changes to tighten up the system. Well, Stacey, since your uh, story about substantial review has been undertaken by the Department of Corrections, that has resulted in a a very significant beefing up of uh, technology and a number of other procedures. The 55 staff who work at the monitoring centre have undergone extra training to help detect those masking the device's signal. And we've brought in some interstate uh, experts uh, to, to 